It is a law few Texans know about, the state's law of parties. Under it, people can be execute, executed even if they did not commit a murder. James Keith shows us how one state lawmaker is working to change that. Kenneth Foster Jr. never killed anyone, but in 2007, he was almost executed by the state of Texas. At the last minute, his sentence was commuted from death to life in prison. We're glad to see him off a of death row. At the same time, uh, I don't even think he should be there now. In 1996, Foster drove a car carrying a man who murdered another local man, Nicholas LaHood. Under current law, Foster can be executed, something State Representative Harold Dutton wants changed. Under House Bill 304, any person found guilty of a capital felony would not be eligible for execution, unless, of course, it could be proven that that person killed someone directly or intended to kill somebody. In 1980, somewhere along in the 80s, we had a person who was given the death penalty, who did not kill the person and had no intention to kill, but they were on death row, and the person who actually did the killing had already been released from a Texas prison. You could be with me and I did something wrong and they make you as responsible for it as me. Jeff Wood's family knows the scenario well. Wood is on death row now in connection with a murder in Kerrville where a store clerk he knew was killed. He saw his friend laying dead on the ground and the gun was pointed on him. And he was told what to do and he did it. His hands never committed a murder. The Fosters are glad to see Kenneth's life spared. Wood's family hopes a change in law will make them as fortunate. James Keith, Fox News at 9. It is believed at least a dozen people who did not commit murder have been executed in Texas. Representative Dutton is calling on the governor to commute Jeff Wood's sentence just in case the proposed legislation doesn't pass.